Hey folks, welcome back to Forever Skies. Yeah, Poncho's exhausted there. Anyway, I'm still sitting over here in the lily pad where we start, where we ended last episode, thinking through my life. <laughs> I did see that we added another potential booster, the blood coagulator, that takes the hemorrhage. Hemorrhag hemorrhagic hemorrhagic fever virus and we found that that was in the cricket if I remember right so right there so we can go and produce that one but we can't go any further without the medicinal reagents uh, let's get you going and here's the fumes I was telling you about last time well that one's only in the middle interesting the last time it was both the outer ones cool. Oh, there's only one item in there. Okay, what was that? Uh, research on that guy, which means he should now be in our list, but I still need the medical reagent. Did get a comment saying I need to head to a greenhouse, a an infected greenhouse to get that. I've seen pictures of those. They're scary. Yeah. You gotta go to the place that's most likely gonna kill you in order to get the thing that's going to save you. At least that's the way I'm, I'm looking at it. So, um, we didn't actually see one out there. Now it's raining, so I can't get up in the air and look around and find one. Let's, let's see here. Let's get ourselves up and going. Grab one of those. And is there any food left over here? No. Let's grab the waters and put you in there. And eat you. Okay, that tops you off. Let's grab a little bit of sleep and see if that takes away the rain so we can get up top and start figuring out where we're going to find one of those infected greenhouses. Now, there are a few greenhouses on the map. I'm on the, the radar. I'm curious if any of them have a different symbol next to them. So we've got the 2.59, the 2.95, not to be confused with the 2.06 and we are slowly creeping to the front I don't see any change any difference in the symbols but we have two greenhouses in this direction so it makes sense to go that way okay so let's pop up in the air uh, nothing we can make contact with here spin around to up in this direction somewhere. Okay, let's get up higher than the junk stream and see what we can see in the distance. So we've got one right there, right above the, uh, the catwalk. I don't see anything on that looks contaminated. Let's go up a little bit higher than these buildings, right? Yeah, we're still climbing. So the other one is going to be off in this direction. Probably that flash we just saw. Uh, yep, so it's a lot further away. So 2.58 apparently doesn't get onto the uh, uh, onto the radar. Or onto the... It's not spawned in yet. That's what I'm trying to say. So we are traveling at about 60 kilometers an hour. I'm not seeing what I assume that the infected greenhouses look like so I'm gonna well I'm, yeah hello unless it doesn't spawn in just yet boy we just bogged down real hard there Poncho what did you do <laughs> I thought the game was about to crash it's like maybe something just spawned into the map that's interesting Let's get a little further this way and see if we uh, we broke something. Hmm. Anyway, we're looking for a greenhouse that is completely covered from top to bottom with a colony of fungus. And it's pretty gnarly looking. It's like being right in the middle of Half-Life 2 or what's the what's the planet you can kind of beam over to the alien planet where they came from in Half-Life. Yeah, it looks like that. Um, so the other one is up in this direction in general. And I've also been, I also saw online 
that this there's there it is right there in the middle the medical reagents are also indeed in the labs in the under dust but it is the second lab you go to is when it spawns in now that's just a comment on you know, on the internet and those are always accurate so we may have to test that theory just to prove it right or wrong there is the the high tower that we were uh, we started last episode at, so we haven't gone that far. So this was the greenhouse off in that direction, and I don't see anything there that reminds me of that. So beyond that, where do we go? We'll get close enough just in case it requires getting close for this to spawn in, but we'll see. Anything else? Let's see, this lock you in uh, there just a little bit. Lock you in, okay. else out there now there were pictures that I saw there were also floating clusters just floating through the air you know spore sacks just trying to find uh, something to latch onto and take over and attack your ship so this could get a little crazy at some point I don't know if they're obvious and you can fly around them or just what all right, so this is not the one we were at, that's for sure, because I can walk right into there. Um, we could pop over here just to see if anything new happens. Oh, you guys are happy. Yeah. Let's, let's go around and land in a direction where these guys can just sit here and do their thing while we're off exploring. All right, spin around. Where are you? Right there. All right, have a ball. Still have batteries. All right, we're coming in. Right about there, drop it in. Ooh, there it is. Okay, I'm looking good there. Good for stats. And now you guys can't find anything, really? Dude, okay. What's in here? And what was that extra noise? I don't know. We got our ship rocking over there. And Poncho's just jumping up and down, having a ball. Oh, we're locked up again. I wonder if we're not entirely stable after this last update. I've got a pretty intense computer, and I shouldn't be lagging this hard. Yeah. That's a weird clicking, chittering noise here. Yeah, I don't see anything. Like, like bees, like, like wings. I want, oh, look at that. Whoa. So, what do you do here? I really don't know. I just came for some more polymer, but apparently we found some bees. Okay. I don't need any more of the epoxy, but polymer is definitely appreciated. <clears throat> yep, we've got bees. Now, I did see a graphic, an image, of taking a knife and cutting a beehive out. How do you not get stung in the process? I don't know. There it is. So do you just stay away from it or do you harvest it? I don't know. <laughs> Where's my escape? You look pretty good for an escape right there. There it is. What do you do? Those are some big bees, too. Those are killer hornets. Do you get up on the roof? Can we get up that high? Uh, I don't know if I can get up that high. I bet you I can get my gangplank up there. If things go really bad, I can jump back on the ship. Whereas here, I have no idea if they're going to chase me all the way out of here. I don't know. <laughs> it's getting exciting. Alright, polymers. 
Take you guys. Kind of expensive to make, so better to find it. Otherwise, over here, you two. Good. Yep, definitely a buzzing noise. Ah, what you got here? Uh, modern table. Okay, empty water bottle. So we're down to just giving out water bottles now. <laughs> all right, so let's. Still got it. I do. Up oh, all the way. That's a way in. Boy, I don't know. Everything inside me says, um, "Don't go there." No, I'm serious. Don't go there. Eh? Eh? E? Go? Well, they don't seem to be attacking. They don't seem to mind my presence. Take you guys. There's some great stuff. And that cabinet's new. I've never seen that before. That's a new addition. Cool. Old can of water. Um, sure. Thank you. And couple of you guys yeah and those are only epoxy so I don't need to get into that boy what do you do here does it give me a cut symbol do I dare get any closer nothing's happening so far I don't oh because I'm immune it's not gonna zap me okay but there's got to be a reason for this. But it didn't give me the symbol of a knife to cut it down. I can get up there. Oh, I can get up there. All right, let's let's deal with this. Okay, this might be crazy. Come in here and there it is. Okay, so I knocked the nest down. The bees have left. Look at that. Interesting. Now what do we do with it? Take thorn bee honey. Consume thorn bee honey. Thorn bee honey. Thorn bees. So maybe there is... Well, honey is antibiotic already. It has antibiotic qualities in real life. So that's probably significant to the subject matter of this game. Dealing with biotics and antibiotics and <laughs> viruses and what have you more of these I got five of those blood coagulant things that we made out of those last time so we're set there for whatever's the game's gonna throw at us looking for more critters that I can make another one of the boy oh, he's noisy up there the uh, hemorrhagic fever uh, things out of are those bees? They're not. And you're right here, ready to scream at me, aren't you? You're not. Boy, I hear you chittering. No. Yep. Where are you? Am I gonna catch this again? Uh, once again, I've got 100% immunity. So why we caught it last time, I don't know. And I see that there's a bunch of coffee around here. Must be over there. Do I need more coffee? Yeah, there you are. Got you. There's another one. Got you. Reload. Oh. That's all I got on me. Ugh. Yes, I see you. Okay. Grab you. Don't need any more canola. Grab you. Don't need any more biomass. Don't see anything else in there. And yeah, let's actually process these this time. Where'd you go? I get you. I got you. Okay. Last time I just stuck them in the freezer. This time we should probably do something with it. 
because it looks like it's not just a one or two episode thing to figure see all the new things and call the game done again we're gonna be here for a while grab you and turn off the flashlight put away the knife what's up in here I don't really have any other uses for the whoa for the chili lobster chilies that I know of I mean, you can use it to make uh, first aid kits, but we've got more of those we know what to do with. And I think there is one other recipe. Go into here? Yeah. So I don't know what else I would want those for other than eating them. And I'm doing pretty good food-wise, so that's not all that necessary. Alright, up this ladder. No, up this ladder. Oh, he's always almost falling. <laughs> Whoa, kind of a you know, Captain Sparrow thing. Now, I've been seeing them off to my sides, but I guess there aren't any coffee beans up here. We went up there already. Okay, drop. What did I see? Over there? It's outside over there. Yeah, I'm not getting that one. Nothing over here. Okay. And nothing else down below here. So I saw that one. Calories level is decreasing. Tis. Now. Thorn bee honey. A handful of sticky sweet honey. Plus 10 food. Plus 10 energy. Minus 20 immunity. Okay. Minus 3 health. Apparently you need to process it to use it. That must be a thing. Okay, well that's plenty of coffee. I've still got all of coffee from last time. And there was no reason to go back up. There's one. I don't think so. I don't get the sense there's anything new here other than the bees. What is that stick doing coming at me? Wow. <laughs> that thing just helicoptered. Okay. <clears throat> Let's head down here. Probably best not while holding a knife. Thought I saw something floating by there. We've been to all of these? We have not. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three. Nothing in there. Oh, didn't mean that. Okay, you. No. Back in here. Okay. Hello. Alright. Well, that was a good quick stop over. Yeah, we've been in there. Where is my boat? There I am. <clears throat> Grab some food so we can get stung if our immunity is up to max and not suffer anything. Good to know. So what do I do with that? Let's grab one more meal. Got you. Okay. And we'll drink these guys just to clear some space in the shelves. And um, cook, cook, pop you open. All right. So can I do anything? Can I research anything? <clears throat> Nothing there. So no new research. We still need to find the gastroenteritis virus in order to make that immunity booster, which is what I would think you would need before you went into the the uh, infected greenhouse. That makes sense to me. Um, the honey doesn't act as a medical reagent. It says we need two and we have zero. Wow, we need two to make that one. So how abundant are these things going to be? Hmm. Okay. Um. Do we try and cook this? Because it's going to make us sick. I guess we could try that. It works with the sun melons. Doesn't make sense to me. I guess so. Cooking honey so it's not 
in its natural state so that it, it pasteurizes it. Is that it? Let's grab some glass. No, I'm at max right now. I can't go any higher. Okay. I don't see any other bee swarms and bee hives in there. Okay. Storm's coming. So let's spin around to grab another greenhouse. Or we can grab the the elevator from here. Which is right out there. Okay. Yeah, I think it's there. Okay. Can't see a thing. Boiled thorn bee honey. Let's go find out what that is. Alright, take it. And there. Caution. A storm is coming. Cooked food is more nutritious. 20 food, 30 energy, 20 immunity. Okay. Let's go drop What's below us right now? We are, we're dropping into the junk stream, unfortunately. I am going down, right? Yeah. Just feels weird because there's no movement. We are descending, but we're in the clouds, so I can't see what I'm descending into. We're about there, and if I was going to get next to a structure, I guess it's over here somewhere. Pop over here and let, the, let these guys take the lightning strikes for us. Something like that. Okay. <clears throat> Out of this, there's still a two day time limit on it. So, open. We're kind of full there. Let's put you guys there and drop a couple more of these in. And let's go make some more of these virus samples with these guys. Analyze and continue. So insect lure, it's still trying to make us cure, man you're noisy. The original photophobia virus up there. Insert lure into insect catcher on the airship. That popped back in even though we did that our first episode. So, that was a bug. At least it sure seemed like it was. And I'm surprised it's still there in the game. Because it never let you adequately solve it. So, if I were to... Well, we're laggy right now. If I were to take you out and put in a simple lure... You... Yeah... I might have to put it into the original. Oh, we're happy there. Okay, and we'll lower the lure. So it's wanting us to go through that whole process again. Uh, check back in a while to see what was caught. So if we run through all of that, maybe it will assist somehow in progressing something in the game kind of riding the storm out here while we're waiting. Okay, so I was saying that even this has a time limit. Okay. Take the moth, and it says eat what's caught to cure photophobia. Optional. Wait for water to condense and drink it. Well, let's just eat what's caught. It doesn't say cook it. It wanted us to eat it and learn the lesson that we need to cook it. So if I do this... Yep. Hurt my immunity, and it didn't do a thing. So this, we're just kind of stuck in this loop. I think it's looking for that very original lure and dust moth in order to satisfy it. And it's kind of frustrating. Anyway, let's max some things out. Let's run both of you guys and get some good nutritional food going on. And get some water. And get our immunity back up. Anyway, you're out of power and you need a crystal battery. Take you. And we have one, two of them. Okay. So you're 
back to where I wanted you to be. So now we need to get a fungal meningitis, <clears throat> which is a what? Fungal meningitis doesn't tell us what that's made of. How was that found? You? It was you. No, no hint there. Yeah, this doesn't tell me that it came from the cricket. And there's no hint here. So I guess you just have to have remembered it. Hmm, not good. Okay, well let's get these guys boiling and move on to our next destination. Right there. And yeah, toss you and water you up. Boil. Toss you, water you up. Boil. Alright, grab some water out of there. Toss some old into there. Close this up and we're good there. So, I want to get you in the fridge. Anything else goes in the fridge? No. We'll put you back into there. You go in with the liquids. You do still have room. Okay. I accidentally got one of these, so let's dump you in there and take that back. Alright. Um, components and metals and polymers. Yeah, in order to go between games, I think I need to do a longer series of episodes of each game rather than trying to remember from one to the other how what the commands are. So I think we'll do Forever Skies for a little while and milk this for all that it's worth. Nothing important there. Okay, so I've got food. I wish you would say you're lacking 30. Then you'd know what to eat. But 75 is huge, so we'll go this route here and call that good. Immunity is back up again. Good. Toss you into here to save you. You do what? I remembered one of these. No, it was the blue one that gives you the oxygen. You can't cook it. It, it just gave you nothing. It turned into rotten food. This one I think I can cook. I think I think that was the case. So let's find out. Oops. Now, is there anything to repair? Because I got one repair kit there that just needs to go somewhere. There we go. Happy day. You go in there, and I feel complete. <laughs> Except I see that I am out of bolts. Those just might be important someday. You're up here. Might be one of those times when I'm thinking, oh man. So, next time we're in the underdust, which is where we're going now. Okay, get back to it. Uh, you're there, I'm spinning around. Under dust was up in that direction. There you are. Up higher. <clears throat> up higher. Whoa. There we go. Under dust is ahead of us. We could make a pit stop right here and just grab some more uh, base materials. Sure. Right back down to the 238 range, 228 range. Right in there, dropping in further. 29, 28, 27. Up there. And touch. Okay. Uh, jump out of this. Let's go hit this place real quick. What are you? 20% health. Oh, that's right. I had seen these. So the lock is broken. We've got to repair this to get whatever's inside. So that allowed us to open it to find... Ooh, some really good lures and some fuel. Okay, that's exciting. Exciting that something new is in the game. It's nice when you find those little surprises. Okay, you in here... I'm still leery of that critter that I know is in this game somewhere, though he may be it might be in the infected greenhouse. That we'll eventually find. Okay, open everything up. T 
take all the things. Data pad. Curved wall lamp. We never get to, did get into those, so we've got to do that soon so you can see that. Those who have not got the game on your own. It's kind of like a rope light. Doesn't put off very much light. You kind of wish that there was more to it. But I, I built one once and thought, that's it? Oh, 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 yeah. Found them. Um, yeah. You're going to stay there? Oh. Yep. Kill you. The heck are you? That's what I'm talking about. Right there. Okay, can I grab you? Am I going to get a disease if I do? A crustapede. Mm. Okay, let's go run that through the synthesizer. Uh, nothing else up here? Nope. Drop, 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 drop. I'm stuck. Oh, I'll take you. Thank you. So we found our first crustapede. Oh, oh, I saw that hole. Dealt with a viral infection. Okay. Didn't know I had one. All right. <clears throat> so, what is a crustapede? Can I shove you into this thing? Oh, crustapede meat. Yeah, it likes it. All right, here we are. Needing to maintain a medium uncharged acid. So let's get rid of the smalls. Okay, get rid of the large. That leaves a small. But you are, you're not going to tell me. Okay, so we'll go with large. And uncharged, positive charge. There we go. All right, one more round. So a lot of larges in there, and a lot of mediums in there. Your medium, okay. Smalls are there, so just as many smalls as larges. And I can't pass over to find out if they're charged or not. Let's go for the small. It's kind of a 50-50 chance there. So positive, got rid of a bunch. But you're a problem. You are a problem. Okay. Alright, do that again. We'll go for the large next time. Alright, get rid of the larges. And get rid of the positives, which gets rid of that guy this time. And that gets rid of the neutrals. Okay. Now, you are the fungal meningitis. All right, so we got you, and take you, and I can't make anything with you, right? Oh, now we can make, yeah, it's just, it's the, the base ones. So, I should have looked at that. <laughs> I know it's you, and... Oh. Okay. We already had that. So where did that come from? And... Okay, what was the third one? You. Gastro. We don't have gastro. That's what I was hoping we were just finding right now. We... Hemorrhage... Fungal... Photo pyrexia. We don't have it. Okay, so you're there. We need gastro. Boy, I thought that crustapede was going to be it. I really did. Now, what made you? I don't remember, but I've got at least three of everything, so there's no point in continuing on. Okay. Okay, well, I'm glad I stopped at this random low platform just out of curiosity. Sure discovered something. And you are boiled meteor bean and was there an advantage to cooking it yeah so 20 energy 10 health 
let's just pop that in right now could use some more well some more waters that's pretty good there let's top off some rest and then move on so there's an advantage now to getting it asleep wake up to maintaining your rest not running on fumes all the time so you're not you but you I can pop you you're good and let's get rid of another one of these waters since they're so abundant and put you guys away and all of you guys fuels we're down in here somewhere bottom one yeah put you in there and there's actually enough to top off our fuel tanks can I do that from here I can good so fuel tanks let's oh we're lower than I thought put you in there and you in there what have you got yeah we've been burning fuel well let's just grab the helium and toss you in there 17 helium is probably worth like 35 of the others so that should be fairly even okay that's done okay you plastic components and waters I guess we don't need to keep them on us we're keeping the water bottle so you can go in there and we are free to go off and do something heading for the underdust okay and we still can't get truly into the underdust we're heading for purple um, because we still don't have the med medical reagent medicinal reagent Okay, you guys grab your things. Good. Probably need to empty those tanks and restock those batteries soon. But maybe w the lab here will show us something. Now, we do have an unusual... Let's hit this place real quick. So what are you guys thinking of these longer episodes? Where am I at, by the way? 40 minutes? Or coming up on 40? Last time was an hour and a half. That was out of necessity. I had no idea what I was doing, so took quite a while to really get moving and doing anything but I could play this game long into the night and not even notice so it's kind of fun just flying around and exploring but it also requires quite a commitment from you guys to want to sit down and watch all this so let me know what your thoughts are on episode lengths hours should that be the max or what um e drop out of this I am ready to go off exploring. How are we doing here, by the way? Let's grab you. So that's a... Oh, that's not what I wanted. Okay. Orange and blue. Yellow. What am I missing here? Metals. Yeah, let's do one of each. I think before I had alternated... Maybe not. Anyways, you got to hold the E so you don't switch. Right there. And we'll grab glass. Same thing here. We're not grabbing iron or metal anymore because we're full. There. Perfect. Let's go put these away, then we'll get back in there. You two and not you. That was a mistake. Oh, we're just about maxed here. Okay. Glass is down in here. Good. And we're good. Alright, so what is this place? I didn't really take a good look before I... That's not a ladder. Here's a ladder. Before I uh, pulled in. Would it give me a hint? What I'm walking into here. Yeah. Alright, you... I don't know if there's anything on the floor in here or not. Nope. And I don't need copper bad enough to use the battery up because I'm going to need a battery in there Hmm. okay so we're looking for crustipedes and we're looking uh, for bee nests and I'm going to guess that they could be almost anywhere randomly that does kind of make sense could even be inside here for all I know any sign of 
Anything? No. So now we do need to really look things over before we just go walk into somewhere. It's possible it's around a corner. You walk in and it's right here and nails you. They wouldn't do that, would they? <laughs> okay, you nothing. Nothing. Got all of those. Nothing inside there. Alright, so we're just here for circuit boards. Alright, around the corner here is nothing. Knife away. Helium tanks. How do you get down there? I'm not making that leap of faith. Ah, uh, there we go. Oh, you gotta be pretty precise over here. Yeah. You I can drop down. Okay. Grab. How do I get back up from there? I go all the way back that way. Okay. Right there. So I'll do this. Oh, we haven't been over here anyway. So a couple of these. And a leap of faith for what reason, I don't know. Nothing guaranteed over there. So let's take you up, take you back down, hop into here. I'm looking in the window the first. Uh-huh, yeah. It's a thing now. Don't assume anything. Ooh, good fuel. Another one of you, more good fuel. Food ration, okay. Around the creepy corner, okay. Cool poster. So that's one thing that they added with the update that brought the repair tools. There's a half a dozen new posters that can be found in the game and I think a bunch of other artifacts too. Kind of randomly found, it's like we found the, the camera that one time. So artifacts like that. Things from the old world. Alright, so that goes back up there and back up there. This goes back up here to another helium tank. Don't truly need the helium, though maybe one of these days we'll play around with helium fuel. We'll see. There's also crystal fuel, too. And boy, we're getting really laggy. Things are bouncing. And when you're on the edge of falling to your death, you don't want things bouncing. Okay, I need to find a way back up to the top. Right there. Alright, well that was a good stop. Put these things away. Actually, let's just head over to the, uh, the under dust elevator. And then we'll put things away and get ready to go in. Alright, up, lift... Uh, obstacles are right there. Go a little higher. And there. Okay. Yeah, actually, we just go high enough to go right there. Doesn't feel like I'm going higher. I am. Okay, mid 80s. Right in there. Where is the ground? What can I compare it to? I guess through the railings. Looking for shadows. Okay. Alright, so we are at our next destination. We'll go to the lab in there and see if that if it does anything. Uh, Food-wise, let's let the food go down lower so we can use that 75. We can keep the other bars up. And what else is in here? Fuels. Let's go put that into the engine that had the uh, the helium fuel in it. it. Was this one? Toss you in there. What are you? You're a cool poster. Let's clean up the bedroom. I'm gonna seal it off a little more. You go in with a knife. Three. You are that big. All right. Jet engine 2.0, faster than ever. <laughs> That's the engine right out there. Okay, so what else have I got? Knife goes back down. Well, we could eat that one, though. Actually, we could. Let's just do that and top ourselves off. In case we run into something we don't want to run into. Alright, so what did I see in there? Was there plastics? There were circuit boards. You're up here. 
Okay, you're there, and oh, that's all there is. Okay, second row of those. And toss you in there, and helium is right below here. And we're ready to go. So we've got batteries. We've got no way to get down into the tunnels again, because we don't have any medicinal reagents. Medical reagents. We do don't need any food or water. We're good. Got five shots. We should, probably should go ahead and pick up some bolts this time. Just because they're free. Now, I keep forgetting. Some of these... Have, I forgot to look at the last one. Some of these have something on the outside that are interesting to look at. This was a, a medical bay of one, of one time. Helping people when they arrived. Otherwise, they'll be, like the last one, a... Uh, a booth off to the side for selling things or what have you. But let's get this guy fired up. Same puzzle every time. This is something that would be nice if they changed up. Oh! I can go faster up the stairs? I didn't know the shift let me do that. I just hit it by accident. If I have it. Alright, pop you in. You there. I always check to make sure that they haven't surprised me with something new, but... That's pretty much the, uh, yeah, same story. Okay. All right. Yeah. There we go. Anything above? Nope, that's the roof. Okay. Pop you. Down we go. Coming in. Yeah, it'd be something if there's some kind of a monster just for just a split second flash through the uh, the screen there. It's like, whoa, something's changed. So this one is different. Whoa. Okay, that bee nest is glowing red. Just saying, there's something different there. Yeah. I was going to say this is a different layout. The first time we've had a different layout because the oxygen station isn't right there outside of this. So they've turned us around to go somewhere else. But I'm going to get stung getting to that. Why is it glowing red? Red is danger, Will Robinson. Boom. At the base. Can I shoot it down? <laughs> I'm reloading. No, did I get him mad? Can I shoot a bee? I'm curious about that. Let's see if I can get one to hover right in front of me for a moment here. Ah, uh, boy, you almost did. All right. Let's get a little closer. Warning. Enter Boom. Oh, oh, I shot it down. You can shoot it from a distance and they leave. Cool. All right. Find bolts. Now you are what? Just Thornby, honey. Why were you so glowy red? Oh, it's another one. Okay, this is now a thing. And we now have a reason to collect the bolts and use this beast. Okay, beast of a gun. A lot of hissing noises. What is the hissing noises? Seriously, what is the hissing noises? It's not you. I don't know. I'm not liking it. Let's grab you. Okay, that's two of you. Wow. Okay, I'm, so, I'm a little spooked. All right. Um, sure, let's... Oh, you take up a slot each. That's unfortunate. Okay, well, let's put this guy on. Let's clean up just this area here. So we have dropped sideways into this room here. No, different room. 
Okay, and where are you? You were locked from that side. That's Oh, that's where the elevator was last time, right there. And we popped this lock and came into here. Okay. Well, in that case, let's clean up, grab another transformer. Say thank you very much. Uh, grab you guys too. And jump up and... No, but I'll take all of you guys. Don't think that's the way I was meant to go. Yeah. There we go. So, polymer. Oxygen is doing decent enough. Is that the hiss of the elevator? Is that what I'm hearing? I don't know, but there's more uh, evil red <laughs> on the, the murder bee nests. Okay, put you away. Jump over. And again, grab you. Look through the window like last time. That's what I didn't see. I, I think I saw that as I jumped last time and I wondered what that orange was. Okay, let's grab some more oxygen. oxygen level is <laughs> Drop off what we found so far. Uh, drink you. Toss you. Alright, let's go find the lab. Which is not going to be as easy this time. Just more bees. Wow. So I can't go running through here. There could be bees anywhere now. So let's go all the way around. This is where we did not go last time. Last episode, I forgot to make the one more turn to get us down into here. And to hit that. But I can't get into the lab. The lab is through that locked door. Lab is there. Where's that locked door? Can I shoot it from a distance okay gotta figure that one out um the locked door right uh, that one right there let's grab top off some air okay so to get to the other side of this through there. Does that... I can't get there from here. Okay. So I need to see that door from another place. And then try to shoot it with the, uh, the crossbow. Which I think I'm almost out of bolts. So it's through here. Ah. Well, grab some bolts. It's right over there. I still don't have an, an angle. Okay, um, two. Does that give me the angle? Right there. Will the game let me do that? No, it won't. Uh, reload. Okay. And why is my three getting all wavy like... No, nope. well, let me go through there. Like I've got... A sickness. Hmm. Now I can do that one. Can I do that from a distance? Okay. That gets me into there. That might help. I don't know. There's got to be a way to solve this. Sounds like I've got cats chasing each other outside of my studio here. Alright. So with that, put you away... What's that? That's number two. Find more crossbow bolts. So, what did that open up for me? Wasn't there. And... Hmm. It's not there. Oh, it's around. Here. Angry plant. Into here. Bees, crustipedes. Oh, okay, that's okay. They're just a little more animated than I remember them before. Okay, all of you, more bees. Break the lock. 
Grab all the bolts. <laughs> and we're back. And oxygen. Okay. So that's solved. So with that, we could use some rest. So any of the of the sodas that we find, we'll drink those. Otherwise, that gets us to the laboratory. Yeah, that was the point of all this. Uh, you can go away. Any bees? Any creepy critters? Okay, this kind of taken on a whole new life when he rotated it around like this. This feels a lot more like like something new. Okay, there. Um, it was immediate. That's right. I missed it last time. So I thought I was at the other end. Okay. We only have so much time. And yeah, if there's a bee nest in your way, that sure kills your chance of... of uh, put you away. Of saving time to... You know, you're about to run out of breath and suddenly you can't get to that oxygen thing because they stuck a bee nest there. Not you. Now, over here... Around there, there, up. All of this to find out if it was right that there is a medical reagent at the lab. Hello. Take medical reagent. There it is. Okay. Bling. Okay. What does it say about it? Organic matter with a highly diverse mixture of antibodies. Okay, is there more than one? There was talk of two, three, battery. Cool. You, ah, drink. Get a tiny little boost to our energy level. Don't need you. Okay, now there was also, read the... Find research reports in the laboratory. So, I don't think it means this, does it? And that, you know, the little pop-up there. So, find research reports in the laboratory. Last time, last episode, this it didn't mean anything. There was nothing here. But there are also no medical reagents, so maybe something has changed here. You, uh, water... I'll uh, just drink that one. And food. We'll grab that. We don't really need it yet. Nothing back behind. And that's all there is. Okay. So let's grab some oxygen. And we head back to the ship now? Yeah, because we can't go any further here without... Let's see. I just want to drop into there. Without making our our thermo what have you booster yeah till we can go down below um i'm at an hour let's make this work can i drop no okay um we're up here let's oxygen don't really need it i was gonna say we could go do that but no nah, let's pass let's just get back down to the elevator so there use drop we have enough oxygen to get there. Let's go make the booster we need to get down below. So that now, another crystal. That grab? Yeah. Through the door. Wow, I'm not lost. Into the elevator. Okay. Let's head up. And... Hmm. I want you guys. I want all the things. Don't need the waters. Don't need these guys. Grab those two. Uh, you can combine with that one, right? We're lagging. Okay. You can combine with that one. And I want the transformer. And I want the polymer. And it looks like I can take one more thing. So we'll grab that. Okay. And boy, everything looked red for a second. Are we at sunrise or sunset? Too bad there isn't a clock built into the compass up there. That would be nice. Alright, run out here. Now we can go make what we need to get downstairs to go and find the new uh, repair tool. Cool. Into here, it's raining. And 
head over well let's unload we're we're maxed out uh there i am so i know there was polymer get rid of you no copper you and nope I'm right above got that one and medical reagents i'll just keep them on me we'll use them all right now uh metal i saw that and i see two things over here got some biologicals and we've got some energy crystals okay uh foods let's just do that and get it out of there we have waters uh four of them okay you guys and that i need to cook those they don't seem to be any good otherwise so we'll toss you in there um boil this didn't go in here did it did i test that does oh didn't test that okay so you are medium uncharged acid so large first one's always easy one step and is done all right so you are medium uncharged acid so that's a large and a small let's get rid of the smalls ah you're a problem i need to get rid of you Uncharged. No, I guess not. Positive. Okay, yeah, that worked. Alright, so... Medium. So small and large. Go with the large. I'm hearing an odd noise. Uncharged. So negative, positive. That gets rid of most. And it's always the last one that gets you. Acid. Oh, nope. It's a neutral. Perfect. What are you? Virus, virus, synthesizing. Fungal. Is that what I needed? Fungal. We have that. Okay. So acid is fungal. Or honey is fungal. Okay. I need a bigger cabinet. Now I thought they're... I don't know. I thought the cabinets were wider. More storage space. Hmm. I guess we can share down here. What were you? What did I put in there? Oh, the... Wow! The blood coagulants have a timer. You! Hemoglobin purifier. I didn't realize that had a timer. I thought I was making those to store them. Bummer. Oh, well. I'll throw those away later. Okay, so let's grab you and eat you. Now we'll toss you in here just in case we need you. Okay, so what am I doing? I am making these guys. They do not. They're organic matter, but there's no timer. So I guess they can be stored. So I need to make a hypothermia booster, which is photophobia. Let's grab two of those. Bud Coagulator Booster temporarily reduces damage received. Okay, so you don't take damage, but when do you need something like that? I don't know. Let's make two of the hypothermia ones and leave the other one alone. So you can stay in there and make two of the photophobias right there. Okay, photophobia, oh, no, not photophobia, hydro, hypothermia, okay. You two, uh, bars are fine, except I could use a little sleep that isn't artificial. Coming in to noon, yeah, we get, there we go. Doesn't really matter what time it is, because it, uh, I don't need two of them. I shouldn't need two of them. Down in the under dust, it doesn't matter what time of day it is. Okay, so one of you still have five batteries. And let's dump some water. Let's have enough bolts. Water goes in there. And five bolts. So four. Reload. And we're ready. Nope. I want you to go away. There we go. Okay, doing it again, doing it again. All right. Round 
around here. Normally I would put an oxygen or a battery in there, but I think we'll do without. Take you. Now I can make it. I got the right one, right? Yeah, okay. Circle. And let's hit our destination first before we start exploring. But do keep an eye open for... Boy, this is right where they should put a crustipede. <laughs> okay, you're done. I uh, don't see any bees. All right, now. Where are we going and why are you so creepy looking? Okay, this is the dead end that... We originally found the little our little uh, poncho at, and they've reworked that so that if you accidentally didn't the first time, you can still get into there if you need to. So if you played this once and made that mistake, you can still go back. Now you look a little creepy. Yeah, maybe it's just the lighting. Yeah, we'll, we'll go with that. Okay, you're you were there before. Uh, three. And what most people miss is that guy right there. We need to charge this guy up so we can get into this space. This might be where the tool is. I don't know. Or it might be up the ladder up here. Okay, am I ducked? No, now I am. All right, grab some air. Put you away. <sighs> grab the battery. Bottle. Have plenty of extra noises. Lots of noises. Probably just ambient noises, but still, there's noises. Okay. Um, I don't remember that being there. Maybe they were. Is it these making the noise? It might be. Maybe eventually those are going to be something. Alright, can't go back any further. Further this way? Don't remember that being there before. You're creepy. Nope, not here. Okay, where am I? Right here. So that wasn't it. Let's explore more of the tunnels before we run out of our hypothermia booster. Um... This was a dead end before, and it is now, too. Grab you. That takes us out. And one of these places had those glands from the the, critter, the creature whose name I've already forgotten. That's what we didn't get last time, when we didn't go to the other entrance. Okay, so you're not here. Are you... You're not here. Okay, so must be up the ladder. Maybe into that, that room that was upstairs there that caught all of my attention that very first time we went into this place and trying to figure out if that went somewhere. It could be that now it does. Okay, that guy's always worried me. But any bees... Yeah, okay. And this room here. Yep, yeah, now we go through into something. Okay, bees. And let's remember the blue things there. They give you more oxygen. The immune system has dealt with viral infection. Okay, thank you, I think. You're down. And they're dissipating. Okay. Sweep through there. Okay, you don't do anything. Anything else in here? This is new. Whoa, 
There's a whole area in here. Oxygen's halfway. Grab you, thank you. Okay. Repair foam. I think that takes the place of our little blue capsules down there. Reed. Repair thrower. Um, wish I could write myself. I don't get the sense that there's anything else here to discover. This is a crashed airship. That's what this is. We're in an airframe. Warning. Oxygen level is low. Yep, it is. Over here... I feel like there's more. Let's... Come on, get up there. Get up there, good. No, that's not what I want. I'm trying to do this without using my bolts, but I'm probably gonna die before I figure it out. So let's just get over here and do this instead. Okay. Now we've got more time to think. Put you away. There we go. So back in there, was there anything further in? That's what I wanted to know. No more bees. Now, let's do that again. I saw that at the last second. So, running up and jump. Was this something? Nope, it wasn't. Okay. So... We discovered something. To-do list completed. Bunches of things. Database. Now, Noah's drawings. Where's the one we just found? And we'll do this when we're not running out of air. Okay. The one about the repair tool. Ah, uh, that would be in re blueprints. Ship workstation. Now, cooker. Yeah, I don't know. Don't have time to really think about it. Alright, so in here, there are more things I want to get while we're here. Before this guy runs out. Namely, out the other side of this guy. Ah, uh, yeah. Bolts. There you are. Okay. Drop. And I think we're pretty much done under here. I want to go out... Was it this way? I think it is this way. Yeah. Now this guy we may have to power up. We'll see. But I want to get into here. And... Boy, this might be the... No, I get one more use of this. But this is where I wanted to go. Lots of stuff in here. Including another battery. And this is where you find the big storage box. Ah, the big storage box is what I was thinking of in regard to having more storage space, not the wall cabinets. Okay. You. Come on, there you are. Jump up. Okay. Which gets me where? Okay, which gets me where? Not up there. Is there. I can't get into that. I can't jump over anything. So what was the point of getting up here? I don't know. It's not there. I can't do that. Okay. Run back out. And we have them to spare, so let's do that. Is there anything else around here that was worth it? Was there more up this guy? Ah, that's what got us up to the place where we found the larger oxygen tank. Yeah, and another battery. And I just walked in here and didn't look up above the, my head to see if there were bees. Yeah, I've got to do that. You are what? You're just a chunk of metal, huh? Okay. 
Okay, I will consume you. Thank you. And we could use some waters and a couple, at least one of those. That makes some space. Um, up on top, insert crystal battery. Nope, don't want to do that. Now there's one more crystal we can get through here. Yeah. And we can pop this. Can I steal those? I can. Four. Just drop that ladder down. And we're done here. There is something right over here. A few more bolts. Normally I pass on the bolts, but I notice our storage cabinet is empty. So I may as well get some freebies here. All right, take you down. And this takes me back down to the oxygen I've already set up, right? No, it takes me to the other side. Okay. Oxygen level is low. Well, we're close enough to... Although there might be bees. There's bees that way. You? Nope, I shot those. Which means home is this way. <gasps> but I want to go back for that bee hive. So, not there. Through here. Beehive in there? Maybe, but oxygen's right here. Okay, so... Beehive. Is there a way to get to it from this side? but let's at least pop through this. Okay. So I would imagine one of the next updates are going to let us go through these doors. I have a feeling all these extra sets of doors are just, you know, future-proofing the game. Already building it into the map somehow. Okay, so where did that other beehive go? Where did I see it from a distance? And where is the opening that brings us out to that dead creature that lets us collect more of those glands? That was here, I thought. I really thought it was here. It's like right there. Okay, you aren't a thing. No. No. We're at the halfway point on O2. Did we come out of this one? This was the dead scientist and the oxygen tank. Yeah, okay. That was different. Okay, oxygen is getting low again. Alright, so it was on the way back from here that I saw the beehive. Where did I see that? No. There's one more beehive. I know there is. Not there. I'm spinning in circles here. Let's go around one more time. Not up there. Not there. Though there is something over there to get if I wanted to collect everything. Over here. Not up there. I know there's one more beehive. Through here, right? Nope. Well, I'm gonna have to say I'm pretty sure I saw it, but I can't prove it. Yeah. Back to the oxygen again. Okay. Um we'll go back through here and probably call this done. At least at least done down here. Boy, that bugs me. I know it's here somewhere. There is one more angry hive in the distance. Yep. Okay. Did I collect the transformer up here? I did not. Grab all of you. 
And we'll do I am full. So let's consume that one and consume that one. Hello. There we go. Maxed out that way. And what are you? More energy, right? Yeah, we'll consume that one too. Cool. Okay. So, elevator... I'll grab you. Thank you. And that's where the old elevator door would have been. I'll walk the circle one more time. Hoping I'm going to turn a corner and say, Ah, that's where it was. But now, not going to be a thing. I'll grab these, though. Later on, as more gets put into the game, I'm sure there'll be more uses for the the energy crystals. Am I out? I'm out. Okay. So, may as well grab those while we can. Let's get you heading up. What else is in here? Just that. And we're ready. Okay. So, only four of the repair foam. Hmm. I guess I can make that now. Most likely. So I wonder if we're going to stop finding repair patches and start finding repair foam everywhere. And did I see that it stacked to 100? It stacks to 100, not 5. Okay. Or we use the repair patch that we can make to make foam, maybe? Let's go find out how all this works. Alright, first of all, let's cook the honey because it made something we already had. So we don't need to save that. Cook you. Nothing else to cook, right? Alright, so... Research. Did we open up anything? We now have the repair thrower and foam. Oh, both of them. And I need a circuit board. Okay. Right there. That's not it, but I can toss you away. Circuit boards are up here. Uh, grab the small stack. Anything go back in? Mm, yeah, you do. Okay. Research you. Look at the pretty flames. There they are. Whoa. <laughs> Alright, you are almost done. Creepy monster there. He's got his eyes up top, his smile down below. Yeah. Repair foam and thrower. That is here. Let's see what that's all about. Alright, so the foam takes repair patches. The tool. Printing completed. Do I have to scroll? Tool, there you are. Takes electric elements. Up there. That's you guys. That's not what I wanted. There we go. And we'll get you going. Okay, foam. 96 repair. Oh, that gave us 100 repair foam. I see. Okay, so you need the repair patches to make the repair foam. Interesting. So I can toss you guys in Printing here completed. and save you. We'll use up four. Oh, you don't go there. <laughs> okay, let's see how this works. It's probably like the bolts for the crossbow. Okay, you load. Okay, let's go use four of them somewhere. Is there anything up here that's been damaged? You're fine. I'm not getting a notice of percentages. Is it just because nothing here is damaged? Nothing here is damaged. How are the engines doing? They're fine. Boy, I want to go fix something. There's nothing to fix. Okay, floor, windows. Hmm. I see something there? Right there, 80% health. So if I just click it, what happens? Blech. <laughs> okay. Or if we hold it and go from 83 to 100, 
like that and it absorbs in the little nano nano creatures are doing all the repairs and that's how it works and that stuff's gonna run out really fast but it allowed me to reload put that all into one stack now there we are 95 so I have got to see you are number five right now I have got to have you on me just like I need the bolts on me that's a slot taken so we need we now need an upgraded backpack to make up for that yeah I'm that's what I vote for so I gotta put all this stuff away I think we've seen all that we need to see we didn't discover anything new right just the repair tool I think so so we still don't have the medical reagents let's do that real quick we need a medical reagent to learn how to make medical reagents oh yes I didn't realize that we'd be allowed to make our own I thought I have to find them every time so you how do you make one of these Okay, you're over here. To make one of these, we need a preternatural seeds. Okay, preternatural seeds. <laughs> Infected greenhouse. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's it. All right, we got to find that next time. So, over here and say goodbye to Poncho. And uh, he just went to sleep. Yeah. So, catch you next time, folks. Thanks for watching. Bye bye now.